Welcome back to Instant Replay Live. We are taking a small break from Child of Light and uh, some of our other games um, just to try something a little different. We're gonna we're gonna play some some shorter games, just kind of get some extra content out there. I forgot to start the timer. Pretty typical of me. <laughs> and uh, Joe, some, some varied. Uh, some varied I'll, this... I'll go ahead. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I'll take player one this time. Is what I was trying to say. Um, so Batman versus Superman. Do we want to do are that? We gonna, are we gonna do? Sure, why not? Okay. All right. Who do you wanna? Do you wanna be Batman? I'll be Superman. You be Superman? Okay. Uh, yeah, because the movie's coming out, so this feels just all too appropriate to play out. Am I just like? You're on the wrong side. Oh, I didn't realize. I, I th you're a player too. Yeah. Well, I know. I, mean, oh, I didn't actually, realize that do... there was one big selection menu. Alternate skins. What do I have? How do you do the Flash skins? X. You have to back out of the selection first, I think. Yeah. Um. Arkham City, sure. We'll go with that. I don't know what the regime is. That sounds kind of cool. That's the um, so this whole game takes place in an all the single player, which I have beaten with every single character. So <laughs> uh, exactly, and in the regime reality, basically all the the Justice League has become evil. Oh no. Um, well, not evil so much as like I mean, it is a form of evil. It's a regime. It's exactly. Control, They've yeah. taken over everything. They control everyone. And so you are the Superman from that regime, apparently. Like a military uh, state, but superhero state kind exactly, of thing? Exactly, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And Batman leads the resistance against them. Okay, and yeah. of course he would. Yeah, it's a pretty cool storyline. Oh, I, I actually like the regime costume. Yeah. Version, right? I kind of hate it, but so, it fits for the regime. It's fine. I mean, and I hate Superman, but I was thinking of actually a, a comic from which I was actually pretty fond of Superman. But we had it, I think we bought it from TriStar, a little grocery store uh, that we used to go to. Yeah. Like, you know, dinky. That was always the... Oh, nice. But uh, it was Batman vs. Alien. Oh, yes. Remember. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, they, they've done actually lots of series of that. And Superman and everyone else. Um, Nick ooh, has a nice lot more hit. experience with this than yeah, I Yeah, it, it's a little unfair because I've definitely beaten the game many times. I got super into this. How do you... Shazam, I guess Shazam's uh, charger was There we go. I've been trying to do this. <laughs> Just get you over here and, and be able to hit you, because I love these cut sequences. They're wow, so ridiculous. Amount of damage this. Yeah, yeah. I hate this game. <laughs> <laughs> And right into that. Um, it is really kind of abusive. I think maybe we should never play this again, but <laughs> um, uh, we were, uh, you were saying, uh, Batman versus Alien. Or, yeah, it was yeah. really cool, because, I mean, you had, like, you know, Superman is much, could take a lot more punishment than other people, so the aliens, like, acid, like, melting through his costume, and, like, him just getting, like, the shit smacked out of him was really, really fun, because it just doesn't happen a lot. I mean, they yeah. always find a reason they make some take some punishment, but it always feels really gimmicky. Mm -hmm. uh, and as a child, I, did, I couldn't recognize, you know, that it was a gimmick, that he was fighting aliens, but it was, like, I just, I, I have a hard time ever finding Superman's threats threatening. Like, they have mm -hmm. to try so hard to give Superman a villain that A feels weakness, sick. or, yeah. I mean, Doomsday was, I guess, you know, another Kryptonian is always the way to go, or someone who has DNA of a Kryptonian, I guess. Um... That's always the way to make him feel vulnerable. And now they have the whole magic thing. Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> I really want... There we go. Oh, I'm gonna miss, though. Oh! Yeah, you blocked. Dang it. Really wanted to pull that off. Um, I, I know exactly what you mean, though. Like, Superman always feels... Like, oh, we're gonna put him without his yellow sun, and then... Okay, well, what is he, then, if he doesn't have his powers? Um, or there's some kryptonite. Uh, he's he's just everybody's favorite character to crap on because. But he kind of is crap worthy. Like yeah, this. exactly. That's exactly where I was going with that. Oh my gosh, you're gonna beat me. <laughs> nah, I don't think so. Uh, check that out. Really? Superman wins. So now we know what happens to Ben Affleck. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I mean, how? What else can happen? Like, I know he's got some power armor in the trailer. Spoiler alert! But yeah, uh, well, that's not a spoiler. Yeah. Um, I just don't. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Um, I mean, well, obviously Superman's going to... I mean, Batman's going to get a hold of some kryptonite. Of, yeah. And, and that's going to be how he takes them down. But then, I predict by the end of the movie, they're friends. You know? Or not friends, or, but, but allies. They've, they've, yeah. Because Lex Luthor is going to be in the background of the movie, I uh, guess. Do you want to see something ridiculous with the uh, Green Arrow character? Sure. 
the arrow as a costume. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> Oliver Queen from the... Well, I mean, he's always Oliver Queen, but... And there's a brief mention of, yeah. of how I feel about that. I love the start of it. And then as it escaped the kind of the Nolan-esque thing that it started as and mm-hmm. became more superhero, See, it lost it for me. And I think you had the opposite. I know, right? exactly. Yeah, the more fun it got, the more and the more the Flash came up. I was super into it. In fact, if we want to just keep going with the theme, you could go play Flash. Um, right. it's, <laughs> oh, it's done now. Yeah, I was, um, I was just looking at interesting characters. Um, yeah, and I think maybe that's kind of so. I think Nolan killed DC for me. Yeah, that's because I love Christopher Nolan's oh. universe so much. A, a jump back thought that I think will will fit in the DC you love. Um, have you seen Sandy Cholera's Batman short film that's on the internet oh, where he fights it. Predator? Oh, it's yeah, so cool. Yeah, that, that's the one we watched way back when we were kids. Yeah, with, like, like high the Joker school, shows up at school. the beginning. Yeah, like, yeah. You made me that. Yes, yeah, it's so good. I feel like that was like the the pre Nolan verse. Yeah, it had perfect that, that grittiness. And that's what I like. That's what I was like getting towards. It was like I just I I need my superheroes to be so edgy now, so dark yeah. and so so gritty. Uh, just just abuse <laughs> the environment, why don't you? Okay, I'll just shoot you then. Check this out. <laughs> I mean, you won the last one even with my abuse of the environment, so... What was I shooting at just there? Hang on, I've gotta... I've gotta game you a little bit. If I have this advantage that's so unfair, I might as well use it. Come on over here, Joe. Hey, just come check this out. Look at all these backflips. <laughs> like, I mean, he does them in the show. <laughs> but imagine if he just did this in the show. <laughs> there was one thing. When I first started watching it, I was like, okay, I like this. But it takes a lot of suspension of disbelief. Because Arrow's villains are so dumb. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Worse than Stormtroopers at shooting. Um, uh, and just, <laughs> all like, he, he's always got the brand. But they do, a, they do a good job of making Arrow feel like more than just a brawler. Like... He does yeah. so much that is. Oh. Look at this stuff. <laughs> this is a very Star Warsy kind of. Yeah, well, it's the whole like Justice uh, League's space lab. So I'm dead. <laughs> you should be, yeah. I'm no Superman. No. <laughs> nice. I didn't even think about that. Uh. Um. But yes. Uh. His, his villains are dumb, and, you know, the thing I have an issue with, with Flash, for a show that I love, is that his villains are all, like, from the same sort, at least at this point. They're gonna fix that in Season 2, I'm pretty excited. Um, but, uh, at this point, everyone comes from the same, like, origin story, and that's so lame. And also, the other problem I have with it is that they all are beaten by speed. Like, that's all Flash has. Well, it's, he is pretty fast. But that's all he has. Like, he's not a, a hero because he's a smart character. I guess he's a hero because he is valorous. But he doesn't do anything. Oh, look, we unlocked something. A hero portrait card. Great. Um, Alright, let's do one more battle. Just like me fighters. Um, he, just, he just feels so, like... There's, there's never a problem he's not going to solve with speed. You know? Mm. Uh, and I guess there's some things I could say about the finale that were good that I won't because spoilers, but... Right. Um, where he didn't just use his speed to solve everything. But it just... It bugs me a little bit. Alright, I'm gonna let you pick and so then I'm gonna pick my character. Is, what, is Robin an alternate skin for Nightwing? Or? Um, he might be. I don't know. I don't know that I want, want to play... Uh, I don't have him if he oh, is. Oh, I kind of want to see Regine Nightwing. Nightwing. I don't think he's that different, sadly. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Let's see how it works. Um, so I, there are some some DC uh, superhero-y DC stuff that I still like. Mm -hmm. uh, Teen Titans was great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I heard um, Young Justice was really good. I haven't watched it yet. Mm -hmm. it was, uh, one of the cartoons. Was it like one season? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. The trailer for DC Online when it came out before the game came out looked super awesome. I was like, man, I could play that. Oh, okay. He is different. He's all red and stuff. He looks kind of like uh, Bucky from... Uh, yeah, he really does. Oh, spoiler. Bucky's a Winter Soldier. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, I think if we're getting this deep into comic show talk and stuff, people will probably have seen Winter Soldier. Or if they haven't, that's not really a surprise. <laughs> have you heard about uh, how Chris Evans did like, a talk show where he was like... Uh, 
pretending that throughout Avengers 2, uh, Captain America was really just searching for Bucky the entire time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, well, they... Uh, wait, Avengers 2? Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, they say that, actually. That they, they mentioned the missing persons thing. Um, and that's a reference to Bucky. They just didn't want to say it out loud, I think. Yeah. Um, but, you know, when, you're, when you've got other stuff going on... Well, I mean, I guess it was there, there was there was a bit more humor in it though. It was, you know, yeah. like he would bust down a door and call on Bucky, and we were like, he's not in this movie. Oh. <laughs> like, look at this stuff. This is crazy. Uh, if by crazy <laughs> you mean absolutely retarded. <laughs> you just got vaporized. Oh, nice. We're pretty evenly matched. Take out my nightsticks. Yeah, well, I mean, they do things. Look at that. I really want to hit you through this. Aw. You got knocked down. There we go. I love these. The area transitions are just so ridiculous. So, like, the idea that it's okay to throw a person through a building that's occupied by people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, I, how many people would have just died? It takes a lot for a fighting game to get me to the point where I'm, like, I'm enjoying more than Smash Bros. Yeah, me, right? and like, this is not that game for you. Or close to it, right? So there's a few that have kind of stood out, stood out. like mm -hmm. Tekken 3 I can always go back to because that was just when we played a lot as a kid. Yeah. But, uh, it's a, yeah. Soul Calibur I love. Yep. But I like that whole series. Yeah. I couldn't get into Street Fighter again. I couldn't get into uh, uh, King of Fighters or and I, King of Fighters. I feel exactly the same way, actually. I don't get into these games anymore. This one was a big surprise for me, and I think it was just because like they did keep the voice actors from the cartoons. So like you're getting all of the, the Justice League voices you know. I want to finish you with the... Oh, oh, nice. I don't know, there's something... This feels very... There we go. Uh, this is how I want to finish you. <laughs> this game feels stiff, though. Uh, yeah. And, I mean, different people have different different tastes, and you, uh, you said you really like this, but... I, no, I can uh, I can appreciate your point, though, because it does kind of feel like that. Mm -hmm. But don't mess it, with the best. it's just the DC flavor that works for me. The, the DC cartoon voices, given cooler looks mm -hmm. is what does it for me in fact so and uh and that that does it my disappeared cyborg terminator style teleported away and uh that's the end of our episode so joe any last words on dc or anything like it um i'm batman <laughs> all right <laughs> hope you guys will keep coming back for instant replay wait, wait, live wait. i do have one last comment <sighs> okay well I just thought, Nick, that maybe you want to ask the audience about their 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 oh, most, did I have most a, underrated. Did I have a thing that I said I wanted to ask? Yeah. I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really curious, actually, about what people's favorite underrated. And I, I think I was going to say DC, but now I'll maybe even open it up for just best underrated comic character because everybody's favorite DC character is Batman, no doubt about that. But who is the the best? character that nobody knows about, or the best one that's just kind of hidden away and needs a movie or needs something like that. I, I have an easy answer for that, at least. Okay, give us yours. Spawn. Yeah? Where has Spawn been in so long, right? Yeah. Like, Spawn is so cool. That's a good one. And uh, I, he needs a new movie that's done right. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. I want Howard the Duck. <laughs> Alright. Bow <laughs> wow. Really kick it. Kick Yo, it. plans, free stroke, Sonic Golf. Sonic Golf.